U.S. stocks opening higher on the first trading session of August after the S&P 500 ended July just two points shy of its all-time record close as stocks continue to focus on central banks. The focus isn't necessarily on company strength. I think the focus is more on what's going to happen from a monetary policy standpoint. All right, meanwhile, General Motors expects the China auto market to surge to 30 million vehicles over the next four years compared to 24.6 million, which was the level back last year, according to a Reuters report. This comes as China transitions to a consumption-based economy, which is set to bring about slightly lower economic growth. And Verizon Communications agreed to purchase Fleetmatics Group, a web and mobile solutions company, for $2.4 billion in cash. The $60 per share Verizon will pay is a 40% premium to the company's closing stock price last Friday. This comes after Verizon announced plans to purchase web giant Yahoo last week for $4.8 billion. And those are your headlines on this Monday. Keep it right here on thestreet.com. In New York, I'm Scott Gam.